Pembroke police are investigating an officer involved shooting here in the valley. It's in the West Valley. Police say it all started with a robbery and 13 Action News reporter Austin Carter is live at that scene in Austin. I understand you just got some brand new information from police. Yeah, they just updated us a few minutes ago. This investigation is still ongoing, but we're told this all started inside the Cash America Super Pond here behind me at Charleston and Rainbow when a man stormed in, tried to rob the place and took one of the female employees hostage before he was inevitably shot by police. Now, this is how it all went down. According to Metro, they received um, a 911 call around one o'clock this afternoon regarding a robbery in progress as officers were responding and surrounded the store. That's when we're told this robber became impatient and grabbed a female employee holding her at gunpoint. He then walked her out of the building where officers were and as officers were giving him commands to put that gun down, the female hostage was actually able to grab the gun from him. It discharged and the hostage was able to rip that firearm out of his hand and ran off. We are told that hostage um, is doing okay. He then reached for another firearm. That's when officers fired rounds at the suspect. He was shot once in the chest and at that point the suspect continued to not listen to commands from officers. That's when Metro released a canine. Finally, then he was able to be taken into custody. That suspect we were told is at UMC tonight in critical condition. Now back out here live, the northbound lanes of Rainbow between Oki and Charleston still still shut down as police can continue to investigate here. So you're definitely going to want to try to avoid this area if you can. For now, I'm reporting live near Charleston and Rainbow, Austin Carter, 13 Action News. All right. Thank